Are you struggling in solving IQR? Good day everyone, I am Eloisa Shancoste and welcome to my segment, Eloisa Helps. For today, we are going to talk about IQR or interquartile range. It is a measurement of the data spread or statistical dispersion. It is the difference between Q3 and Q1, where Q3 is the upper quartile and Q1 is lower quartile. For better understanding, we have an example here. The scores of 7 students on a statistics exam with a maximum possible score of 60 are represented by the following measurements. Find the IQR. 40, 40, 45, 47, 54, 57, and 60. First, we need to solve for the Q1. The formula is 1 fourth times n plus 1. 1 fourth is equal to 0.25 and n is equal to 7. Therefore, we substitute it in the formula. Q1 is equal to 0.25 times 7 plus 1. 7 plus 1 is 8. Therefore, Q1 is equal to 0.25 times 8. And we get the answer, Q1 is equal to second data point or 40. Next, we need to find the Q3. The formula is 3 fourth times n plus 1. 3 fourth is equal to 0 0.75 and n is equal to 7. Again, we substitute it in the formula. Q3 is equal to 0 0.75 times 7 plus 1. 7 plus 1 is 8. Therefore, Q3 is equal to 0 0.75 times 8. And we get the answer, Q3 is equal to 6 data point or 57. Lastly, now that we have the value of Q1 and Q3, we now can solve for the IQR. The formula is Q3 minus Q1. Q3 is equal to 57 and Q1 is equal to 40. We substitute, then we can get the answer of 17. I hope that you understand and gain knowledge. See you in our next episode. Bye! Yay!